How is how is it how is it how is it going? How is it going guys? Welcome to the Driven Media Garage. Probably my best purchase besides the GR86. Oh, these are actually pretty heavy. Look at this. I've never been able to actually use a creeper without having to worry about bashing my forehead in everywhere I went. This is, this is so nice. They're finally here. that. is way too loud, especially the cold start. It is ridiculously obnoxious. I feel bad for my neighbors because I already told them that the cars would only be here for a couple weeks because I thought I was moving warehouses. <laughs> Turns out they're actually staying here. This thing is so filthy. Oh. Let's see what the damage is. you can stick some pool noodles into the tailpipes and they act sort of like silencers to help cut down on the noise. Not sure how well this is gonna work, if at all, but I figured we'd give it a go. It's gonna look silly as hell. Surprisingly, the pool noodles actually did seem to work for a little bit until they got shot out of the exhaust, which is obviously a problem. So uh, I don't think this is gonna be the solution.
what we're gonna be installing is a brake light that's incorporated into this black trim piece that goes across the trunk. Hey, look at that. This one is actually smoked out. I've got everything roughly reinstalled and wired up, so let's peel this off and I shall show you how it looks. Oh, I wasn't actually expecting another box in here. Feels fancy. Well guys, Grid Life Midwest starts literally tomorrow, but as you can see, the FRS is still in my garage and currently up in the air. I think the motor has decided to do Subaru things because as I went to change the oil, well, this stuff came out. Ugh. Hit that like button to show your condolences. made it. We are in Los Angeles, California, a long way from home, but we're picking up a new car today. I cannot wait to show you guys what we're gonna be taking home. This is my brand new 2023 VB WRX. I missed being in an actual Subaru. I missed the, the force induction, the turbo noises. We are partnering up with Aeroflow Dynamics on this build. Hello. Is that Spam Subi? What's up, fool? Look at this thing. taped up, so let's get this stuff out of the way. Guys, it's actually freaking happening. 
Now I told you guys, I have got some big announcements to make. The GR86 is going to SEMA this year and it's gonna be featured at the Coney booth right smack dab in the middle of Central Hall. Let me introduce you to the new Driven Media headquarters. All right, I'm just kidding guys. I can't afford this big ass building. Driven Media isn't doing that well, but we are gonna be renting out a small portion to turn into our own shop and warehouse space. Now let me just take in what I just said. I can barely put into words how excited I am to have my own space again. Winter is right around the corner. I've been dreading having to work in the garage again. So I've been grinding as hard as I can to be able to afford my own space. And that hard work is starting to pay off. And I have you guys to thank. Each and every one of you helped me pick myself back up and get me where I am today. I'm blessed. I love you guys. I'm never going to stop saying it. I could not be doing what I'm doing if it weren't for you guys. Give me a second. So these are some of the things that need to be installed on the car in the next two weeks. Now we can carefully take this off and set it off to the side. We can pull the one on the driver's side off as well. got both the lights installed and plugged in, so let's get the bumper back on the car.
made it to Vegas. We picked up the car. It made it safe and sound. There was a little bit of drama. I'll fill you guys in once we get to the hotel room. So here's the plan, guys. We're gonna be changing out the suspension system on the GR86 and installing the new Kony suspension right here in the parking garage. Not the most ideal situation. We don't have the nice tools. We're actually missing the handle to the jack, which makes things a little bit difficult, but we're gonna get it done, and then we can take the car, get it washed, and then finally load it into SEMA, and then I can show you guys the rest of the stuff I've done to the car. It's not really that much different, but I think it looks spectacular. I can't wait to show you guys. Let me show you guys a quick look at how the car sits now. Mm -hmm. 